Hi, this is Shamal Thacker with the Pocket Design Series. We're about a week out from the Design Summit, and I've got Jim here with me. Jim, can you tell us a little bit about yourself? Hi, uh, so my name is Jim Roland Hagen. I work for Rackspace as a software developer, and I'm the project technical lead for Ironic for the Metaka cycle. So Jim, according to the user survey, Ironic has been gaining a lot of adoption. Can you expand on what Ironic is? Yeah, so we're really excited about the adoption we've seen. Ironic as a whole is just about um, provisioning bare metal servers. Um, it started out as kind of a project to do that in a cloud-like fashion, um, treating servers as uh, cattle instead of pets. And we've been just pushing forward on that goal. Um, there's some other projects we've seen to um, help more of the operator experience around that. And one of them is Bifrost. Um, it's essentially a set of Ansible playbooks to quickly deploy Ironic in a standalone fashion without the rest of OpenStack. And from there, be able to spin up bare metal servers from an inventory. So folks have been using that to kind of spin up bare metal servers ad hoc, you know, if they're setting up like a small cloud, just spin those up and then they can go in and provision them from there. Um, and I think that's a really valuable use case. Uh, some of the more pet-like use cases can use that. Um, we've also seen a lot of work on Inspector, which is a project to um, get things into Ironic. So you bring your racks into the data center, hook them up, and just start them up. Inspector takes care of the rest. It goes out, it boots a RAM disk there, it figures out everything about those servers, I think this ecosystem of tools we're building here is going to be really valuable for operators. Very cool. And I know Ironic also moved to Semver or independent users. How's that going for the team so far? Uh, so far, so good. Um, so it took us a while in Liberty to get our first release out. And within a month and a half, we had two more releases, uh, the second of which had something like 30 or 40 bug fixes in just a few weeks. Um, so I'm really excited about getting features and bug fixes out to our users faster, and I hope to do those even more frequently in the future. So during the design summit in Tokyo, what were some of the hot topics that the Ironic team discussed, and what were the decisions? So a lot of our things came down to um, just general stability. Uh, there's a few different things we're working on on that front, mostly around testing, um, some of the Nova interactions and that sort of thing. And as far as uh, users or operators are concerned, what were some of the needs that you identified uh, to solve their problems at the summit? Right, so the Nova thing is a big thing. Um, right now, there's not much HA or room for failure in that integration, and we are going to fix that. So given that focus, uh, what would you say are the top three priorities for either new features or enhancements to existing ones? That's a big one. Um, another one is just general better testing. Um, and then a lot of our users have been asking for good RAID support and um, networking support with Neutron. And so being able to do some of that is what we want to accomplish this cycle. Great. And then generally, the product work group has been using the concept of themes such as scalability, resiliency, manageability, modularity, and tropability to kind of help users understand uh, direction where projects are headed. So could you elaborate on possibly where some of the key themes for your project in Nataka? Sure. So as I've implied, um, resiliency is a huge one for us. Um, making that story good, making things well tested, um, just generally releasing good software there. And then um, scalability is a big one too. Um, the Nova changes I mentioned will help us scale out to tens or even hundreds of thousands of servers. Just to elaborate on the testing thing, um, we're starting an effort to have third-party testing for all of our drivers. Um, so that's going to be huge for us, just ensuring that those all work as expected for our users. Um, and beyond that, we would love some help. Uh, if you can write code or review code, please come join us. Great, thank you. We look forward to amazing things from Ironic and Taka. Thanks for your time, Jeff. Ditto. Thank you very much.